Hello, I'm Barbara Elman. Welcome to Maxine Green Institute's Salon Series. The series is a series of conversations that will include talks with artists, scholars, educators, students, and others interested in the work of Dr. Maxine Green. We hope these salons will provide a place for an exchange of ideas and a sharing of artworks, teaching practices related to aesthetic education, and examples of social imagination. After each installment, online we aim to continue the conversation on our website via the conversations feature. These are a sampling of the salons we have planned over the next few months. And introducing them are members of the Maxine Green Institute Board and part of the events committee. Holly? Hello, I'm Holly Fairbank. I'll be hosting our first salon in this series, a three-part conversation with storyteller, musician, and poet, David Gonzalez. <clears throat> David will be performing some short stories from around the world and walk us through some aspects of the craft of storytelling, including words, voice, movement, and imagination, and what he calls technologies of enchantment. Joining us will be education students from various CUNY campuses who have studied aesthetic education. Maxine was a big fan of David's and described his performance in her book, Variations on a Blue Guitar. What we shared with David was an enactment of art making, someone raising up a world before our eyes through movement and the sound of his voice and the expressions on his face. And by means of my imagination, I can make it my own. I hope you'll join us. Heidi? Hi, I'm Heidi Upton. And I'm going to be hosting Matt Green, who is a walker extraordinaire. Maxine, in her writings, her teaching, and just in general all the time, encouraged us, urged us all to awaken to the world around us and to connect ourselves in authentic ways to this vibrant place. Matt Green is one of those people who has a life practice of the kind of wide awakeness Maxine proposed. Involved for several years in a walking project that encompasses all the streets of New York City, one that was documented in the film, The World Before Your Feet, he will share how active noticing, placing oneself in the moment at hand, leads to much more involvement in multiple layers of knowledge. Hope you can join us. Susan? Hi, I'm Susan Thomason, and I'm going to be hosting the next salon in the series, a studio visit with visual artist Barbara Elman, interviewing her and exploring her work. Barbara's splendid abstract paintings, both individually and in groupings, draw on imagery from memory, experience, travel, the everyday world, traditional and handmade objects. We'll be zooming in and zooming out to find the relationships between color, form, pattern, and space, and doing what Maxine called lending the work your life, finding our own connections and meanings. Jean? Hello, I'm Jean Taylor. I will be hosting a salon with students from the New School's College of Performing Arts. We have worked together on a course called aesthetic inquiry. And in the salon, we will discuss the relevancy of inquiry and wide awakeness when applied to the world around us. We also anticipate hosting a salon with poet Amanda Gullah. Barbara? So stay tuned for when an individual salon will become available. You can watch our website or check your email for an announcement. We look forward to seeing you there.